Hi, Brandon here again with Hydroflex. Today I'm going to be showing you how to clean and replace your Y strainer on your booster pump. Because a clogged Y strainer screen can significantly decrease the life of your pump, Hydroflex recommends that you clean your Y strainer on a monthly basis. Before we get started, you will need a few tools. You will need an adjustable wrench capable of opening at least an inch and a quarter, as well as some compressed air or a wire brush to clean the screen. First, we'll need to turn off the inlet water supply to the pump. Once the water supply is turned off, we will need to bleed off any residual pressure by manually opening any valve by pressing the red button on the air valve located on your Aqualab panel. Once residual pressure is bled, use an adjustable wrench to remove the large Y strainer cap. Once removed, you can set aside and also remove the Y strainer screen. There may be residual water that will bleed out as the cap is removed. If you are replacing your Y strainer, you will need to remove the blue gasket that is on your strainer. Next, we can take our filter screen and clean it using a wire brush or compressed air. Make sure you do not clean your screen with chemical. If the Y strainer is unable to be cleaned or is damaged in any way, you may order a replacement strainer screen from Hydroflex. One thing to note that there is two different strainer kits that we offer. The brass body of the strainer should be marked with either a T15 or T16. If you are unable to see the markings, you can use a ruler to measure the Y strainer screen. The T15 screen will have a 2 and 5 8 inch replacement and the T16 will have a 1 and 3 quarter inch replacement. To reassemble the Y strainer, put your new or clean screen back into the housing. Next, if you ordered a replacement, screen, put on the new gasket. If you are not replacing your screen, make sure that the gasket is still intact. Now we can take and hand thread our cap back on. And then use an adjustable wrench to tighten it down. Once you finish replacing your Y strainer screen, you will need to turn your inlet water supply back on and prime your pump. For instructions on priming your booster pump, refer to your Aqualab user manual or click on the link in the description below for booster pump priming instructions. If you do have any further questions on how to replace your Y strainer on your booster pump, feel free to give Hydroflex a call at 952-808-3640 or you can visit us on our website at www.hydroflexinc.com. This is Brandon and I'll see you next time.